Hi, I'm Tim. Welcome to our channel and thanks for logging on. Today we're going to be discussing the Audemars Piguet Jules Audemars Repetition Minute Tourbillon, a watch that is effectively a grand complication of the grandest type, both a minute repeater and a tourbillon, crafted in beautiful 18 karat white gold. You can see this grand complication on our website, purchase it there, and if you enjoy these videos, please subscribe to our YouTube channel. You can also click on the card in the upper right hand corner of the screen at any time during this video to see our full listing for this watch with additional accessories included, high resolution images, and naturally full pricing details. On my wrist, six and a third inches, 16 centimeters in circumference, this watch is beautifully proportioned and in any sense, a giant in terms of stature, if not an outright size. Now the watch is nicely sized, 39 millimeters across the round of the case. It's a nice compact 46.5 from lug to lug and only about 11.5 millimeters thick. So this is an easy watch to wear with a formal cuff or tight dress sleeve. You can see the conical shape of the bezel as well as the slope of the case flank, even with the repeater slide, an easy watch to wear with formal attire, but casual enough in the design of its dial and combination of black strap, blue dial, and white metal that you could wear it with short sleeves and no one would bat an eye. This is a versatile watch. Now in white gold with a mostly solid case back and a very substantial deployant, it's hefty in the hand. It's what you wish a grand complication would feel like. If you got the chance to handle one, this is the kind that would live up to your dreams. It's that impressive. Now you can see the strap is a beautiful dark navy blue monotone stitch rectangular scale alligator leather and it's paired with a white gold single fold deployant blazoned with the AP initials inside fully polished beautifully finished it's as substantial as the watch and it nicely counterbalances the heft of this white gold case I'll show you the case reverse quickly because the focal point is the tourbillon. The watch is beautifully crafted around its caliber 2882 32 joule manual wind and you can see in glorious fashion, that tourbillon beating away at 3 hertz at 6 o'clock on the dial. With any tourbillon watch, the tourbillon is going to be a focal point, and this one is beautifully revealed. You can see everything from the overcoil hairspring to the balance to the escapement. You can see it just beneath my thumb orbiting the center pivot sitting side saddle in classic tourbillon fashion. So it's a 21,600 vibration per hour beat rate, and it is a one minute tourbillon, absolutely hypnotic. It's beautifully mounted on a gorgeously angled tourbillon bridge, just as beautiful on the reverse as on the front. But this watch, again, pleasant because it gives you the privilege of seeing the tourbillon without having to turn it over to get the best of the movement aesthetically. This watch is all about its dial. And the dial deserves a shout out because it's a little bit more adventurous and avant-garde than you might expect from a grand complication of this stature. You can see entirely in blue mother of pearl, it has a geosphere pattern at center with a railroad sector outboard of the hours and all highly stylized Arabic numerals fully loomed surrounding stylized white gold leaf hands at center. This is a spectacular watch to behold in daylight, low light, or no light. And I'm actually going to do a loom shot. It's not often that I take a pure dress watch into the realm of the loom shot on this channel, but this watch deserves it, if only because the style is so confounding to those who expected something conservative in this price range with this stature of complication. So let me go. Charge it up. And now let there be light. I don't know about you, but this is downright thermonuclear. Now, some dress watches have little pips at the four corners, maybe a little luminescent pearl on each hand. This thing makes a statement in the dark. It has as much character lights out as it does lights on. It almost defies the original purpose of a minute repeater, which was to convey the time in the absence of artificial lighting. This is a spectacular watch, just as much with the lights off. Again, maybe even more so. So we come back to the light. And finish the essentials. This is a watch that's handsome, versatile, aesthetically, technologically superb, with a movement constructed by Audemars Piguet's high horology sector, Renault Papi, expressly for watches of this caliber. They're the people who build the highest end Audemars Piguet's, the Breitling for Bentley, Moliner, Tourbillon, and of course the absolute top of the line Richard Mille. This watch, again, with a no compromise combination of style, complication, movement finish, case finish, and dial innovation, delivers on every count. If you can imagine 
the thrill of holding a grand complication, of exploring and experiencing its functions. If you were thinking about something almost mind-blowing, an earth-shattering, perspective-altering timepiece that's literally the stuff of dreams in your hand, look no farther. You're looking at the Jules Audemars Repetition Minute Tourbillon, a grand complication from Audemars Piguet, available for purchase on our website.